I've forgotten how to do this again. <laughs> hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video. I still don't know how to do this, but I'm trying. So this week, uh, today is Monday the 8th of March, and I have a week of holidays, so I'm not working this week, so I figured I would pick up the camera and film a bit more because this week is going to be a bit different to the last vlog I filmed which I still haven't uploaded. <laughs> I filmed it and I've edited most of it, I just haven't ended it properly and my issue is I've now gotten like not scared but like I'm more nervous about uploading it again because of how long it's been since my last vlog which is kind of silly I shouldn't feel that way but I do I filmed it probably about two months ago and I've been sitting on it and it's nothing it's not like a special video or anything but there's a lot of things that I done in that vlog that it would be nice for me to look back on like I was saying in my last vlog at some point I think that me and Juan were looking back at my old vlogs a little while ago um, when I used to film more and I miss it, I miss, like, I love living in the moment and that's sort of what I've been doing, I guess. But I also love just to look back on what we've done and how things have been. But yeah, we're going to have a chilled morning and then I'll probably catch up with you when I'm going to make lunch. But yeah, just one last thing. One of the things that I wanted to do in this vlog is show more of the food that we eat. I've massively recently gotten into, like, Cooking, I love cooking. I try and cook as many meals as I can. I never used to cook much, but it started when I made bolognese and then I started making more things and now, and now I'm still, I'm not a Michelin star chef, but I just like cooking. And there are some things that I make that are more like Portuguese, Mediterranean inspired, that kind of thing. So it will be nice for my family to see that as well. Because I always mention it to them, but it's difficult to describe, like for any Portuguese viewers, for example, frango a bras. It's fried, fried chicken kind of thing with eggs and patata palha, which we don't even have patata palha in England. It's like little really thin, tiny uh, chips, crisps. <laughs> so it's really difficult to explain. So if I do make that this week, which I don't know if I will, it will be good to show. So it's very zoomed in, um, but it's time to make food now. So I'll show you what we're going to make, what I'm going to make. So on today's menu, the main thing I'm doing is pasta with uh, black olives, tuna, broccoli, and then there's just a little bit of garlic and um, olive oil as well, but then for me, I'm just gonna use a little bit of the pasta with this mixture With one of these little chicken fillets. I love these. They're so good. Okay, so I have the Water boiling and I've just drained The olives. I don't know if this is a common thing that people actually do in Portugal, but um, me and Joao before Covid happened uh, We used to go to this place. that's called Italian Republic I don't know if it's worldwide, but there are quite a few here um, and in the malls, so like in the big shopping centres, there's the option to do like create your own pasta and Juan would always choose pasta with olives and broccoli and that's what he would always have and he loved it and then a couple months ago I was like, hmm, I want to try and make that at home and it's really good for him. I don't like olives personally, so I pick out the olives and have something else with it. But he really likes it, his brother likes it, and so does his mum. So it's something quick and easy that I can make for them. So the pasta is now in and cooking and I have just put into this pan here the olives, the olive oil, and also the garlic. You can see the garlic paste a little bit under there. I normally always put in a lot of olives because uh, Joanne's family loves olives. So always make sure to put a lot of those in. Um, I will also put in the tuna at the end, I need to drain it. <laughs> My chicken is now cooking in the oven. We have this cute little mini oven so I don't have to turn on um, the big oven all the time. So it's really helpful actually. The weather outside is so nice today. It's not picking up on camera because there's a few clouds. The main reason why I wanted to film, like doing food, is because there are a few meals that, like I said before, 
we don't really do or have uh, in England. And I do a salmon dish as well. Salmon dish. It's just salmon and baked potatoes, but it's so good. And I'm so proud of myself for learning to cook and love to eat fish as well. I never used to eat fish before I moved here, but now I eat a lot of different fish. So the pasta is now cooked. I didn't make enough for me, so I'm now just gonna make a little bit more um, for me to have with my chicken. But this is the fun part. So I have already put everything in here. I'm just gonna turn the hob on. And this is how it turned out. So this is uh, Jamal's plate of food. Lunch is done. Oh wow, my thumb is so weird. So I'm not gonna go eat. I'm gonna go get uh, Jamal's food to him and then I will catch up with you the next time I do something. So I don't know if you can hear me, but we are at the train station. Uh, we've just come out for a, well, a walk, but to come and pick uh, Joanne's mum up from the train station. So we have a couple of minutes to wait, but Mikey loves, yeah, that's your name. <laughs> he loves coming here to meet Joanne's mum. He always runs to go see her. But yeah, this is our like daily walk other than going out with the dogs. We are now getting ready for bed. As you can tell, it's dark. So tomorrow, Joao has his MRI. So we need to wake up at probably half past six tomorrow morning, which is really early. It's gonna be an early night for us tonight. Um, I didn't end up filming much the past couple of days. As you can see from the previous clips, on Tuesday, Jean had his MRI. Um, I was feeling very conscious about filming in public, and then when we came back, we were so tired, and Jean had a nap. I was reading. So yeah, didn't end up filming much again on Tuesday. Yesterday, literally didn't really do anything. I went and done a big food shop for the week. Today um, is Thursday. Today is Elvis's birthday. So right now I'm gonna make two things. First of all, making bolognese for lunch. It's 10 past 11, so I'm about to start making that. I'm just gonna make a couple of little pup cakes. <laughs> I found a recipe online last year and I made some for Pluto and Mikey's birthday and they love it. It's basically just banana and peanut butter. I will also film that. But yeah, I'm making bolognese right now. I have everything out and ready. So I have my mince, I have the tomato paste. I have tomatoes. I normally use chopped tomatoes. However, they didn't have them. They only had the tomato, like they only had whole tomatoes that have been peeled. So I'm gonna, blend that to make it obviously a sauce and then i have some basil i have some what is this how do you say it in english rosemary i think this is rosemary i have some worcestershire sauce they call it molly english here some garlic paste and i'm gonna i also grate up some carrot probably not all of this but i bought these out because they need to be eaten and if not i will take the rest of it to Joao. Tomatoes are now blended, so I now have my tomato sauce ready. I just realized that I'm wearing white and I'm making bolognese, so this is probably gonna go bad, so I'm using Joao's and Mum's um, cooking apron. Now, this may seem like a lot, but um, I essentially, in the next five minutes, I'm gonna start leaving this to just simmer down, and a lot of this does sort of not go away, but I guess it like evaporates. I don't know the technical term for it. Okay, so the bolognese is done. It has a little less sauce than I originally planned for it to have. However, it tastes incredible. I am going to sit down and just do uh, short medication. 
affirmation for the week. I do this once a week. This is done, so they're all uh, loaded for the week. I think we might watch something on Netflix, not 100% sure. Oh, I need to show you the cupcakes. So they are done, they're just chilling in here. When Joelle's mum gets home at like 2.30 um, and she's finished having her food, we will give the babies one each and then we'll save another one probably for tomorrow maybe the weekend okay so i'm just hopping on here to end this vlog um i don't know what this vlog is going to turn out to be i haven't filmed it again in, an in another couple of days but i think i filmed some stuff that is cool i guess that i would want to look back on so we'll see what this vlog turns out to be and see how long it takes me to get this one edited as well but i am now about to transfer the clips so i do have them um, and then I can get it ed edited and uploaded. If you did enjoy this video, please make sure you do give it a thumbs up because that helps me out a lot. If you want to see more of my videos, do subscribe. I am going to try to be uploading more often. I can't guarantee when that will be, <laughs> but I will try and upload as often as possible. And I do still need to film that video with you. I'm actually going to end this vlog now. So I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.